talk of budget sedans and this is something that consumers are quick to lap up and this is the Chevrolet sales sedan one of the few offerings in that segment which has recently got very tempting well I'm going to tell you what is right about the car and what is not so right let's start with the former Now something which is right about the car is its proportions. Now I'm not just talking about the width of the split grille in front or the wide angle headlamps, but I'm also talking about the boot which sort of seamlessly blends into the body. And it is it just looks beautiful and the transformation is pretty well done from a hatchback to a sedan. Sale, the name is Bangkok. Now something which is not right about the car are the interiors which are pretty much basic. In fact the dual tone sets a tone of monotony and the central console is also not very bright. The rising sun cluster up there doesn't help the cause either and the steering wheel controls have gone absolutely missing. Now that is a pretty critical omission to make in a car of this segment. And there's a funny cost cutting on the Chevy logo which has lost its golden lush. If you're going to be driving this car in bumper to bumper traffic then you'd be pretty impressed by its clutch which is extremely light and well talk of suspension just throw the car on the potholes and it will confidently come back to you and say hello bring it on i'll say it The GM sales sedan is being offered in two engine proposition. One is the 1.2 liter petrol, and the other is 1.3 liter multi jet engine, which has obviously been developed by Fiat and GM in conjunction, and which is what most of you are going to be driving. But unfortunately, I am not driving that. Now the car is pretty bad in manufacturer's point of view, but maybe he wants me to experience the best of his world. But the world wasn't really the best in petrol. The top end wasn't very punchy and felt a bit breathless over 120. It is eating into sales you were spy. Now that overall dilutes the portfolio of General Motors. That said, it is replacing the dying brand Avio, and I must say it is a job pretty well done. The lessons have been learned. <laughs>